I actually feel quite sad about going back to the lodge this week. Stop playing with it and just eat it. Oh, it's all cheese. New magnets. Fridge magnets. 21 have arrived. Postcard style or can be cut down. Right, we're just pulling up at the beach and the cloud is going to go behind the sun in the next 10 seconds and then that'll be it. Welcome to a new vlog, guys. We are packing up. We are going back to the lodge, taking our food back that we haven't eaten this weekend. I actually feel quite sad about going back to the lodge this week because I feel like We've had a lovely week here with the girls in the caves and my mum and sister we went for that little walk and we went to um, Saddleworth and Upper Mill and just had a nice week here at the lodge, uh, at the apartment. So it's finally finished the apartment, just a few bits and bats to do but when we come back from now on it's just enjoying the area, enjoying the apartment, coming back to see family. It's leisure now. It's leisure, no more DIY, it's leisure. So, are you ready? Well, a little bit. Yeah. We're going back. Um, I'm calling at the hospital on the way back to the lodge. I've got to do an MRSA swab for my hernia operation, which is next week. Uh, and then we're going to also going to call at Junction 32 retail outlet because there's a gap outlet there and they are all closing. So Nick wants to get some shots. He likes gap shots. Come on then. Let's make a move. Right, swab all done. It only took like a minute, if that. Yeah, put your pants down. No, I just push it down my pants. Um, and we are now heading to Escape and Junction 32 Outlet Shopping Village. Need to stock up on diffusers and oh. I want to go into Gap. Well, the last time I went into this um, gift company, they didn't have any of those diffusers that you like. I know what you'll like the look in though. Right, here we are. Junction 32 yeah, Shopping that. Outlet. Costa. What? Huh? Straight to Costa. Okay. Just in the queue for Costa, it's a right queue. It's so busy today, I don't know why. I'm going to rent. No Go thanks. On. So uh, this is the queue to get in. We're going to be waiting a while. Mm. I actually think, think you went to Planet Vegan. Wait a minute. To get that cheese. What that is that? That's not yours. <laughs> That's yours. So you've got a, a vegan one as well? Yes. Well, you, rate, you, you rated them so much. I yeah. Thought. I thought I'd be vegan for a day. Well, we'll see what you think to it. I thought it was beautiful last time. What is this though? Uh, lime and coconut cake. Mm, I'll try a bit. Stop playing with it and just eat it. Oh, it's all cheese. Where's, yeah, where's the cheese? I think it must have gone to other half of yours. What a plasticine sandwich. It's um, vegan. It's corn, ham and vegan cheese. Not bad, it's really nice. Your other one will be better if that's not got all the cheese on. Yeah, like that one's full of cheese. Oh yeah, look at that. Full of cheese. Told you, they got rid of all the normal ones and replaced them with those in the gift company. Told you, didn't I? All gone. Right, successful little shopping trip. We'll show you when we get back to the lodge what we got. But basically it's pillars and some bits of bath clothes. And we'll be back to the lodge in about 29 minutes. We've decided we're going to call into the lounge, have a cup of tea, um, before heading across to the lodge and unpacking the car. Dog shit sandwich. It's a dog shit sandwich. What is it? Cheese. From Wednesday Dale Wednesday, Creamery. Wednesday, Lay, Lay. From the Wensley Dale Creamery, which we've got there. So this is just a normal, like just cheese. normal plain oh. Wensley Dale cheese. That you have. Don't, no, no, don't eat that because that's for the sandwich. I want a little bit. It's coming up your side. Right. And I'm going to have it with this. So it's half a sandwich before we have pizza and pizza and chips. Strappy cheese lovers, then. tomato and chili chutney. What do you get off your backside? Excuse me, we're working afternoon. So aren't we all? Right, we're going to go for a walk since we have not had a walk in, well, over a week. Oh, we have actually. We've we walked at the apartment, didn't we? Yeah. Right, well, we're going to have a walk maybe down to the sea and um, see what it's like. I need my sunglasses from car. Nice and calm, isn't it? I've never seen it as calm. 
I just need a plastic bag to sit on and then we can kind of sit in what? I always remember next time, bring a plastic carry bag. There's no wind. And what just... wind there is is warm. Yeah. Nice and relaxing. Then going home for pizza and salad and more sex life on Netflix. Excuse me. Right, we've just been for a walk around the park. Been down to the sea, it was lovely, as you saw. Just come in, put the pizza on, and discovered that it's mouldy. Even though it's like four days before it goes out of date. Then, decided to make a salad, and saw that the salad is out of date, and we only bought that at the same time. So we're having to race down to the uh, co-op and buy some bits, because we also need some fruit for breakfast. Come on, man. Come on. Here, with a salad tonight. Do you want some hard boiled eggs? I would rather eat my eyeballs. Yeah. Pizza substitute. Tatey tots, crab cakes, and salad. Thanks. Are we ready to go yet? Not yet. Our Patreon and YouTube members, new magnets, Fridge magnets. 21 have arrived. Postcard style, or can be cut down? Postcard style, it's a magnet, or yeah, uh, people can cut it round so it looks a bit like a... Uh... But they're going white for just so you wouldn't be able to tell anyway. Yeah. So these are going out to certain tiers on our Patreon. Um, so I'm just uh, about to... Cut them all up. Package some more. Oh yeah. Well I'm going to watch our travel day again. So first, probably the second time I've watched it actually, and I'm feeling very nostalgic. You get on with that. Yeah. Right, that's what I've done so far. So I'll be posting some off today. We are going to. Oh, that's something that I'm going to show you later on um, uh, in another video as well. Nick's just getting his hot tub things ready. We're gonna go and head to the beach, head to the post office, head to the shop, because we've got an Amazon parcel to pick up um, tomorrow, which will be next vlog. Tomorrow we're going, we're going to go ape on the segways. Need to charge the GoPro. Need to charge the GoPro today. Um, just wait for my moisturizer to dry. Uh, ready? Uh, almost. We're gonna go to the beach while the sun's out. Hopefully it'll last. It's gone already. We found a nice little secluded area, haven't we? It's our own little private spot. Yeah, so we're gonna hopefully go and get that and then we'll go to the shops on the way back. I thought, so, I thought you said we were going to take a picnic or something. I'm not hungry though, are you? Well, can't be a picnic without any food, can it? Mm. Right, I've got to talk quickly because we've got some repairmen coming to do some repairs on the lodge, but um, this is the shopping hall that we got from um, Gap yesterday, because they're closing down in August. Um, we decided to go and stock up on shorts because they are quite cheap at the minute, I think they're half price. And then also, I've got this t-shirt which I got from Blue Ink. The repairman have just oh, randomly come. They're we're, here. We were going to the beach, they've just come. They're going to knock in about one minute. Right, we're just pulling up at the beach and the cloud is going to go behind the sun in the next 10 seconds and then that'll be it. Well, so we are... Umbrella. What? Let's take an umbrella just in case. Are you still packing up? Yep, because it's a tight spot. So um, there's the cloud, there's the sun, it's going to disappear and um, we haven't brought any snacks either so this might not last long. Mm. This is a nice little cafe that we like to go to, uh, the old, poffice, old post office old poffice. tea room and shop. Fortunately, she doesn't open on a Tuesday, which we did know. She's a very nice lady though. She, yeah. uh, she, she knows us. She knows our regular things, what we eat. Yeah. So, uh, so the sun has gone behind a cloud, but it doesn't matter. It's nice and warm. We're just going to have a little chill. This village always reminds me of Cornwall. We said yeah. this before in a vlog, haven't we? It's a little village called Mapleton, which is north of Withensea and south of Hornsey. And it's got the same kind of gantry that goes down to the beach as you yeah. see on Port Kernel Beach in Cornwall. And these houses at the end are all different colours, like blues and greens it's and creams. Very Cornish, isn't it? Yeah. Sun's come back out. So we're just heading down to our little spot. Nice secluded area. Got the beach towel. Got a golf umbrella quite choppy out there but it's, there's hardly any wind, I don't know why it's so choppy. It's lovely and warm today. Right, you get set up and I'll be back in 10 minutes because I've lost, me, I forgot my phone in car. How is it? 
What? Well, just the, the situation, the experience of being on the beach. Well, it's the blocking view, so it's a bit shit at the minute. It's the but best view. Know. It's the best view. Here, I'll let you get lumpy bit. I pulled all stones out, but you'll have to make your sand flat and give yourself a head, a pillar. There you go. The only bad thing is there's a bit of a manure smell, isn't there? That's from farm at top of the hill. Yeah. Quickly, quickly, it's starting to rain. That was short lived but nice. I say it was short lived but nice. Now we're going to go for a cuppa. We just made it back in time, it's just started to ram it down. Right then, that screwed his plans for having a cup of tea because we were planning having it outside. We'll have it inside instead. Come on then. <laughs> Right, we're just having a spot of lunch, a uh, ham and mustard sandwich, and then I've got to nip round to um, Mountain Warehouse. Because, oh, not today. Yeah, well, we're here. My bag is all ripping at the top. I've not even had that a year, but I do like that bag, so hopefully I'll get what the same one. Disney one? Um, I don't know where that is. Yeah. yeah. Back at the lodge, just looked at the calendar and realised that. You're a tool. Nick said the. No, no, no. You said it was tomorrow. You said it was Wednesday. Do not blame me. Nick said the segue was tomorrow. I didn't. I've just looked at the calendar and I put it in for Thursday. So I just said, Are you sure it's tomorrow? <laughs> we can stand there and say I'm that. I'm not lying. No it's idea. just the fact. This is what happened. The exact words you've just said. I've just looked in the calendar. It's down for Thursday. Will you check it, please? Mm -hmm. You didn't say that. I said it was Wednesday. You cheeky. Anyway, it's Thursday. It's not tomorrow. So, Nick's got some hellos to do whilst um, we debate whose fault it is. Nick's got some hellos to do. Right, so hello to, oh, hold on, uh, Hannah Triggs, uh, Pam C, uh, Lindsay, just a minute, it scrolls off the screen, it's a long name, uh, Lindsay Goodwin and uh, Kelly, M Kelly McMillan. Hi guys, welcome to welcome our guys. recent YouTube members. I've just been doing some more of the um, magnets, getting them sent out. And why also, why should you handle this? This is what we went to pick up from the Amazon locker. Nick's new lights for the apartment, inspired by Brad, Brad. from Sex Life on Netflix, because he had lights all over his apartment. Nick, Nick absolutely loves light, loves lights. I love they're, they're mood lights. They're not. They are, they're actually spotlights. They are app controlled and Alexa controlled, but you, you don't actually see the light. You just see the diffused light. So these are actually going to go behind the sofa in the apartment in a group. So I can change the colour of the entire apartment wall and ceiling to like purple, red, blue, green, whatever. Okay. Now we're off half tea. Date night. Mm. Right, so for date night I've been forced to get fish and chips. Looks like Moby Dick. Because they didn't have anything healthy on the menu. But it does look amazing, I must say. Mm, that's gone from delicious. Yeah. So we're going to eat this, go home and watch more Sex Life on Netflix. Yes. Yeah. I've got a big zit on my head, so I've had to put some cream on it. <clears throat> so we're back from the pub. I had ice cream when we got back. And, um... Yeah, it was actually a really nice meal. We've got our third watch party. Fish and chips. Was that the name of the watch party? The fish and chips I had. Third watch party <laughs> of the week, which is the episodes five and six of Sex Life. I must admit, the first two episodes were alright, the second and third... Oh, sorry, first two, third and fourth, I found a bit boring. So we'll see what it's Third and fourth are boring. Third one was the best episode ever. Well, yes. One particular scene, anyway. I do some comments of the day. Thanks for commenting on our videos, guys. Uh, Jacqueline Hall says, Can't wait to see your glorious flowing locks like Watson's. Be a while. Um, Wendy Griffith says, Go Ape is brill. So glad you've done it. You've got some amazing footage. Great bit of Rowan Nick. You've packed a lot into that mini break. I'm so happy for you both. I've just realised I'm charging all the cameras for tomorrow and we're not even going. No. Harriet B says, can't beat a brewery to our cheers. That reminds me, we drove past one the other day, didn't we, close to the apartment, which we think we might do. Salt air. Um, it, it was a big, I think it was a restaurant. It used as well, to be called the Tram Shed or something like that, didn't it? it or something like that. Really now, nice. it's, now it's brewery to us. Fat is going good, change it. It's fine, carry on. It'll make him nervous now. 
I'm gonna go change it. No, no, carry no, on. No. Make it nervous. No, because if it, if it cuts off halfway scene, it might not save the scene. Oh, for God's sake. You never know. I'll just go change the battery. Back. Nerves got the better of him. Yes. And I've changed my t-shirt. Well. <laughs> That's what I was in there. I'm sure I must have had my hair cut in that last one. It wasn't Why would it itchy? It wouldn't uh, So, let's have a look at some more comments. Um, Life as Lisa says, that diner looked so good. Lee, Lee I really enjoyed your hair. And that reminds me. Um, when we were what leaving the, to the, the day? apartment yesterday, well that was life with Lisa, so I just wanted to say, when we were leaving the apartment yesterday, Lisa is our friend, she uh, has the channel life She's very Lisa. straight laced and not... I don't think she is, she um, comes across as like, definitely uh, not. quiet and what have you, but she's not. She's they a dark say, horse. The quiet one's the worst, and I agree with Lisa. If you saw in lockdown, Lisa sent Nick a colouring book of Willie's. And so, Which is in my top drawer, with a couple of pages full of colours. <laughs> we got this yesterday, and it says, thank you for sharing your... Recent favourite scent with me. Nick was talking to Lisa about the scents from that Rituals. Yeah. yeah, she went and ordered the same one from Rituals. The I think she said the Jing one, and uh, mm -hmm. Simon Young as well. He ordered the Jing one. Both of them said that they do smell like Abercrombie and and Fitch. So she says, I thought I'd share my favourite with you too. Hope you enjoy. Lots of love from Lisa. So these turned up. Wax see. Willies. Let me make it focus. There we go. There we go. So Wax Willies. This smell. What flavour are they? Well, they smell of bubble gum. What flavour are they? Snow Fairy. Let's have a look. Well, is that is that the flavour? Is that the company? Um, I don't know. So these are for the wax. Oh, where does it smell smell? Put away at the minute because oh. we've got the new. Oh, it does smell of bubble gum. Oh, that smells nice actually. It smells just like bubble so gum actually. Thank you, Lisa, for that. Are you sure they're not? Is it wax or is it chocolate? No, she said it's her favourite scent. Well, look on the no. I don't think it's chocolate, you can try it in it if you like. Well it says, oh yeah, it says wax melt safety. So, thanks for those Lisa. Yeah, thanks Lisa. Pamela Willett says, you suit your natural hair colour, look in the comments, it seems you have more people who like it, it can be more ageing to colour your hair. What do you think for that then? I was watching back <laughs> the video from the Go Ape um, myself the other day, just to make sure it was okay and everything, and got to the end and I saw my white hair and I thought, oh my god, I look 60 years old. Silver Fox. <laughs> Not that there's anything wrong with being 60, it just, it, it, to me, the white hair ages me at the minute and I just prefer it darker. Uh, and goth for that. Um, Julie Daly says, great to see the family again and because of you both, my family and I went to Disney World for the first time this past April. My nine year old son had an amazing time when we ate at Ford's garage. Where have we been late? Oh, it's um, where have we been recently? You said it looked well, like Ford's garage. Gem Speed Shop. Was it Gem Speed Shop? Yeah. Uh, and one more, uh, Tuzan says, yes, do a vlog on the GoPro as I bought one a couple of years ago, but I haven't used it much as not sure how to. Well, a lot the, a lot of the Go Ape um, Zipwire vlog was actually filmed on the old GoPro. The old GoPro, yeah. The new GoPro, we've started doing speed up scenes on it, so you'll probably notice a little bit different when we're driving, it's more stable, and it's it's, it's almost like a tunnel effect, isn't it? Because it's window mounted as well now, so. The new GoPro is definitely easy enough to do a vlog on. Yeah. But it's, it, all GoPros are a bit shitty in low light. You'd have to have very good light. They're very grainy in, in when it's dark. So, Nick's just had some um, ice cream. Ice cream. I'm going to have some, and then in half an hour we've got the watch party. You got some Mrs. Darlington's? I want my hair to grow. Me too. That's what I want. Right, we've finished our watch party of Sex Life, having a cup of tea and a slice of toast, and then we're off to bed. Look at the camera's nerves. <laughs> From the big Brad Cooper thingy majiggy. So I'm just about to watch Jojo's new vlog. He met with Paula Abdul around um, Disney World. That exciting. She's still around? Yeah, in America, I think. Mm -hmm. I used to love, well, she was on, um, I think she's on like American Idol, if that's still going, I don't know. Oh, she's um, a judge on that, aren't she? Yeah, uh, but I used to like her when she was a singer. I don't know if she's still a singer. And she did that song with a cat on the video. What? Two steps forward. Two steps back. That oh, that's old. Yeah, she still looks good though. Uh, so that's what I'm going to do now with a cup of tea. And um, thanks for watching today, guys. Hit the like button, click the notification bell, click on that subscribe button if you are new around here. The next vlog will not be go ape, but I've got a few ideas of things that yeah, we're going to do. Yeah, you screwed that one up, didn't you? So we'll see you later. <laughs>